Hello everyone, my name is Chandra Vaparwinski and I'm an Applications Engineer for GoEngineer. And today I want to show you how you can save out your deformed shape on your parts assembly that you've run an analysis on with simulation so that you can insert them into other assemblies or print them out so you can show people how these parts would deform under loads. Now here I have a turbine blade that I've run an analysis on and I've actually tried putting on a 30 millimeter displacement along an edge and this is the overall deformed shape that I have from this 30 millimeter displacement. And I want to show this off to everyone else on my team. So in order to do that, uh, what I would need to do is I would need to save out the deformed body. Now to do that, we have to come over here to the results folder right click the results folder and you'll notice that there's a create body from deformed shape. So I can save it as a configuration within this model or I can save it out as its own individual part file and give it a specific name for either for the configuration as well. Um, if I'm running a nonlinear study like I am here I can plot it at a specific time step when doing this as well. And if I look at advanced export options I have a couple different methods I can export it at. I can do it as a SOLIDX body, a tessellated body, a surface, or even a mesh. Now right now it says that the mesh is not access accessible and that's because I chose configuration in this model. If I switch it to new part file I'll be able to select mesh off of there as well. But I'm just going to go ahead and choose configuration in this model and click the SOLIDX body. And when I do that, I'll close out because I've actually already done this already. What I'll do is let me switch back over to my model. This is what it looks like before it's deformed. And when I switch to my configuration to 30 millimeters on each side, this will give me a representation of what the deformed body looks like that I can then send out to a 3D printer so that we can have this made and show people a physical model of what the deformities would look like when displacing this 30 millimeters for this. This has been Charnji by Fabrinsky, and I hope you enjoyed this video on how to save out your deformed bodies from your simulation into individual part files. Mm -hmm.